looking this morning to keep you all safe during severe weather season that's coming up. Our entire Storm Shield weather team will be at Woodland Hills Mall today for the Severe, we severe Weather Awareness Expo. That's where we find Storm Shield meteorologist Taft Price this morning live with a preview. Good morning, Taft. And good morning, Will. We are starting off with some beautiful weather outside. We're going to talk about severe weather inside later on today. The Severe Weather Awareness Expo, the first annual right here at Woodland Hills Mall, kicks off at noon today, lasts until 4 p.m. And there's plenty of agencies out here that you can talk to. You can ask all those severe weather questions that maybe you've wondered for years and years. All the Channel 2 meteorologists are going to be here, and we're going to have some of our toys out here as well. It's going to be a great day. Get out here and enjoy. I'd love to see you. Well, first of all, let's talk about weather. And we have seen a few showers across eastern Oklahoma early this morning along a cold front, mainly in east central Oklahoma. A few showers over in Sequoia County. Most of that activity has pushed off to the south and east into Arkansas and it's faded away. Well, temperatures right now here in eastern Oklahoma are setting in the low 50s. 52 officially here in Tulsa. North winds around 7 miles per hour. So very pleasant start. That sun really feels good out there. And most of eastern Oklahoma in the 50s. We have a few areas still in the 40s at this time, but temperatures will warm nicely under mostly sunny skies. We'll see winds shift around to the northeast then eventually to the east at around 10 to 15 miles per hour as we move on through the day. 60 degrees at 10, 70 at 1 p.m. and we'll finish up the day at 75 degrees. So picture perfect weather to get out here to Woodland Hills Mall again for that first annual Severe Weather Awareness Expo. We're on the first floor right outside of Dillard's. You can't miss us. And again, as we move through the next several days, we're going to talk about even warmer temperatures as we finish up winter and we move into spring coming up on Monday. It's all coming up in the Storm Shield forecast. Will, back to you.